special guest starting this brand new first day of 2024, 2024, uh, for, um, and that is my beautiful, 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 beautiful granddaughter, Ariella. Say hello, Ariella. Hello. How old are you, Ariella? Ten. Ten. And is this your first, very first diamond painting? No. No? No. You have, you've done another one? Oh, yeah, it is, it is. It is your first one? Yeah. And, um, where did you get this painting? My, my grandma. Your, your Mima. Mm -hmm. Mima. Let's, let's give the folks a look at your, your canvas here. This canvas was a, um, canvas from a shop on Timu. Um, let me see if we can get down in there and show you that thumbprint. It is a lion overlooking the world. What do you think about this canvas? I like it. What do you like about it? Um, that sometimes like when I'm bored and I have nothing to do, like I, I can just um, do it. And also it's like... God looking over the world because it's a lion looking over the world. Yes. Did you give this painting a name? Yes. And what's the name of the painting? Father. Father. Oh, what a beautiful name. And, um, oh, I love your shirt, Ariella. Where did Thank you me. get that shirt? Walmart. And what does it say? It says, bless girl, and I forgot what it says on the back, but it says something on the back. Oh, too. it does. Oh, be the sunshine in someone's life. And then, let's see, what does it say? Hold still. Let your light shine before others so that this, so that this may be your good works and give all glory to your Father who is in heaven. Matthew 5, 6. Oh, that's just beautiful. That's just beautiful. So here, what are you, what do you do? Are you, it looks like you're kidding up. Yes, correct. Uh, okay. And so what are, what containers are you using to kid up? I'm using Tic Tac containers. Okay, very nice. Well, while you're doing that, do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Sure. Uh, what school do you go to? Um, I go to a Christian school, a oh. private Christian school. And what grade are you in? Fifth. Fifth? How are your grades doing? Pretty good, but I haven't got my grades for this semester, so I'm hoping that I get A's again. Oh, what did you get last semester? A's. You're a smart cookie, aren't you? Who taught you how to study so good? You. <laughs> I love you, baby girl. <laughs> Go ahead, work, work. Um, <laughs> get this kitted up. Um. You have lots of friends. Yes, you could say that. Do you have a boyfriend? No. So just girlfriends for now. Yes. Smart girl. Smart, smart girl. Stay far away from those boys. <laughs> oh, let's see. What else can I ask you? What would you like to have the people know about you? Are you baptized? No, but I want to be. And um, are you taking classes to to be baptized? Not yet. 
Um, are there classes that you take or do you just say you want to be and then you do your statement of faith? You get a packet that you have to do. And then, I don't know, but I've done the packet and then I'm pretty sure you just give it to the people. And then you talk about it and then you choose a date and then you get baptized. Uh-huh. And you give your statement of faith or your testimony. Yeah, your testimony. In front of how many people? About like 5,000. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so we go to a mega church. <laughs> that's in our area and um uh yeah it's it has lots and lots of people are you gonna be scared i'm yes i'm very shy but you you've had some training correct because you were in the choir yeah but you were with other people yeah this time you're gonna be all alone but you're going to have your Mima and your mommy and your daddy and all the people who love you the most um, very close by. Okay. <laughs> we look forward to that day, that wonderful day. How, did you tell me how old you were? Did you tell everyone how old yeah. you were? Okay. Um, so, you're a beautiful girl who makes very good grades who loves Jesus, who has lots of friends, and has a new hobby of diamond painting. What happened there? It was too much to feel this. Oh, oh, okay. So you know what um, Mima does in that case? Um, I put on your Tic Tac container, put a little star or a dot or something that will tell you, you've got a baggie of extra diamonds. Um, put your extra diamonds that you're shaking there off your hand into your little boat so you can put them back in your baggie. There you go. That's my girl. And you've got you've got some in your um you've got some in your um funnel that you can put in there. And then that will help you to put it right back into your baggie. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Um now on your um Tic Tac container, are you putting just your symbol or your symbol and your DMC code? I'm putting just my symbol. Okay, and so on your baggie, what are you putting? The DMC code. Are you putting the um, symbol as well? Yes. It might be helpful if you do because then when you go to like if you say, oh no, I ran out of W's. Then you can look for a baggie that has W on it. Rather than, you know, trying to figure it out. It'll just be helpful in the long run. Anyways, you got a lot of really neat stuff for Christmas, didn't you? Yes. So, one of the things that you got with your diamond painting kit was this. A container as well right that holds what is that how many um, how many uh, containers do we have it looks like it's all ready for your next one, project two, three, four. Oh, one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six six sixty and then up here you have some pens and some um, wax and some bigger trays. Over here you have a smaller smaller kit that has your Tic Tacs in it and some smaller boats and baggies. And um, you got a portfolio as well too, didn't you? With a light with a light kit, a beautiful, nice, nice light kit. 
Okay, so what's next? What, which one are you doing next? What did you, what are you doing with that one? Are you putting it back in here? Yeah. Yeah, as long as you have it marked, yeah, there you go. You can um, put it right back in there. So what do you do for fun? Um, sometimes I do this. Sometimes, like, sometimes I just, like, my parents will be watching TV in the living room. And I have this little table that I get and I put it into the living room. And, like, I do diamond art kind of while watching TV. But, like, basically just, like, listening to it. Uh-huh. And sometimes I also go on my iPad. And sometimes I watch TV. And sometimes, rarely, I... I go play with my neighbors. Rarely? Yeah. <laughs> we won't go into that, okay? Um, next, um, what about, do you play any musical instruments? Yes. What do you play? I play guitar and the flute. You play the flute? Mima didn't know about that. Do you have a flute? Um, is that for, for, do you play the flute for school? Yeah. Like I'm, school band? I'm in the band. And you play guitar for, is that for the school band too? No. And what's the guitar for? Just like a, for a hobby. Okay. Um, and is it electric or? I have an electric one and an acoustic one. Wow. Wow, very nice. And who got you into guitar? My grandpa. Your grandpa. Grandpa Jim? He's a funny guy, isn't he? Yes. He loves you so much. You know, he, I, he can't say enough good things about you. He loves your voice. He loves everything about you. You are his sunshine. <laughs> okay. What else? What other things do you like? Um, I like school. Well, yes. Um, okay. Um, I like drawing sometimes. Drawing. Okay. That's good. And you like, obviously, you like arts and crafts. Yeah. And you like your music. What, oh, do you have a favorite song? Not really. Not really? You just like all kinds of music? Yeah. Mostly I like country, though. Oh, country music. Okay. Do you have a favorite artist? No? no. Okay. Um, what about, um, your favorite color? Blue. Blue? Mostly baby blue. Mostly baby blue. Okay. And, um, what about your favorite, how about your favorite food? Spaghetti. You like spaghetti better than pizza? Yes. <laughs> but not if it's the Costco pizza. I'll take... Costco pizza over spaghetti any day. <laughs> okay, and what's your favorite pizza? Cheese. Just cheese. Just plain old cheese. Just plain old cheese. Costco plain old cheese pizza. Okay. Um, what about, do you have a favorite dessert? My mom makes cheesecakes. She makes, she makes them really so good, cheese. good cheesecake. So, so good. So, so good. Um, what's, what's Mama's name? Christina. Christina. Um, many and my viewers have heard me talk about Christina a lot. Um, she's my daughter-in-law, and I just love, 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 love her to death. And um, a funny thing happened to you in church just recently. Like on um, New Year's Eve candlelight service? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you want to tell that story? 
Of the candlelight service? About the funny story about you and your dad. Oh. So, we were waiting for um, church to start because we usually get there early. And um, my dad likes to make funny jokes. And I, and so he told me that, oh, what are you going to do with your hair? Because it was like a special day. And so I told him, oh, I want to straighten it. So I straightened it. And then at church, he was like, your hair smells like toilet paper. <laughs> and then the girl sitting next to us was like, what? I, why would you call like your wife or your daughter or whoever say that their hair smells like toilet paper? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> smells like toilet paper. And he was like, not use toilet paper. And then, <laughs> and, then, and then a couple minutes later, she just walked away. <laughs> Went to another seat. Oh, that was, were you embarrassed? Not really. <laughs> You're used to it. Yeah. <laughs> You knew he wasn't being mean. He was being funny, right? Yeah. <laughs> you think he's a funny guy too, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Are you a daddy's girl? Are you a grandpa's girl? Okay. <laughs> do you like to cook? Yes. And what do you cook? Well, I don't really cook, but I bake, and usually I like making cookies with my grandma. Ooh, nice. Very, very nice. Uh, what did grandma get you? What did your grandma get you for Christmas? So, my grandpa built me a, um, a go, not a go-kart, I forgot what it's called. A uh, mini bike, a mini bike. And so, she got me a helmet. And she also got me like this hard candy, hard candy. And she also got me a baby G watch. Okay. There's something else she got you. Something to bake cookies with. Her. Oh yeah, she got me um I forgot what it's called, um An apron. An apron, yeah. <laughs> and what did Mima get you last year for Christmas that you can use with uh, that apron? Oh, uh, kids' cookbook. <laughs> that's right. And it's got lots of cookie recipes. Uh, let's see. What else can I ask you? Um, we went over. Um, what's your, oh, do you have pets at home? Yes, we have two pets. And what are they? Dogs. And what are their names? Marlin and Boss. And do you have a favorite? Don't tell Boss this, but Marlin. <laughs> I like Marlin too. Marlin is an old, very, very old girl. She is a um, Labrador, right? She's yeah. golden, a golden Labrador, and um, just as sweet as pie, just as sweet as pie. Um, okay, so did you make those bracelets? Bracelets you were? I made this one with my jewelry, jewelry making kit that I got from my for Christmas. But this one, I didn't. Okay. Where did you get that one from? School. Oh, from like a craft? Uh, uh. Well, tell me how you got it from school. So, we have like, I forgot what it's called. But it's a place where like you put all the lost and found stuff. Uh -huh. And on the very last day, if the people don't, don't don't get it then anybody's allowed to get it oh so it was a lost and found grab yeah nice very nice very very nice okay um what is do you have a favorite animal dog dog and um if what about wild animals what's your favorite wild animal Wolf. Wolf? Yeah. 
Okay, now you told me, Ma, something else. Do you remember what you told me? Oh, lion. <laughs> you did. You told me your favorite animal was lion, that you identified with a lion. Really? Yeah, you did. That's huh. why I got you this painting of the lion. But now you're saying wolf? That's okay. You're allowed to change your mind. Maybe your next canvas will be a wolf, but I'll probably check with you to see if it's changed. <laughs> Do you have anything else you want the people to know about? Not really. Okay, so we've been running this um, interview for about 20 minutes. And how far along are you on kidding up? I've got a few colors done. Okay. All right. So how about I just um, let you get back to your work. And uh, we'll be spending the rest of the day diamond painting together. I want to thank you, Ariella, for allowing me, Ma, to interview you. And thank you for coming and spending the day with me. And diamond painting with me. I love having my own special little diamond painting buddy. You're welcome. I love you. Me too. Bye-bye. <laughs> Say bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye. <laughs>